Well, we got the plane pulled, got it all loaded up, and we are headed to Louisiana. Going to spend a few days at Daddy's, and um, anyway, we're just ready to go. Yeah. Weather's looking great. Look, it's, well, it's looking good here. We may have to wait a little bit before going into Monroe. There's some some bad weather there, but it may clear by the time we get there. If not, we'll just take a little pit stop somewhere and call it good. So anyway, have have a good day. Bye. Bye. Our traffic skyline Angel Pontico taxing around a barrier 36 Jabara. Colonel James Jabara Airport. Automated weather observation 1703 Zulu. Wind 310 at 08. Visibility 10. Sky condition clear. Temperature 09 Celsius. Dew point minus 04 Celsius. Altimeter 3025. Remarks. Density altitude 600. Spar traffic skyline 80. I think oh, taking 36 to bar. with the heat. Yeah. At least our feet aren't roasting. I know it. You were you have to wear long socks. You have to wear thick wool long socks if you fly a 182 in the winter with a heater on. That's right. Or it will literally boost your ankles. I know you you can't stand it. You're so I'm sitting there pulling my feet back trying to <laughs> I don't I don't quite have that luxury. I know it. Oh, okay. I'll turn this down. Hello, everybody. We are back in here again. That kind of, depending on weather, we took off VFR today. Uh, I, I don't know that I really have a desire to get my commercial rating, but one of the things you got to do is uh, do uh, uh, a long cross country with. Uh, two stops, one of them being a 300 mile total at least, with one leg being at least 250 miles away from the departure point. So we kind of thought that Monroe has some weather issues a little bit this morning. So what we kind of thought, we'll just take advantage of that a little more southerly, maybe land at a spot or two, just to meet that requirement. Yeah. It's, it's kind of a, a might as well. Yeah. And, and yeah. So that's kind of what's on path for today. Because uh, uh, Rustin's about 350, 350, uh, 400 total. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So, uh, so yeah. anyway, that, that'll at least give us, we'll meet three requirements. So, although we may get there and the weather turn nice, they forget it and head cool. home. But uh, we're going to attempt it anyway. That's right. It's be 300 nautical miles total. So here, here's what we're looking at. Go here to logbook. But a reports commercial. Page traffic here, one helicopter turning left base, 35 left page. I need a 300 nautical mile cross country, which we're going to get. It's 400. Okay. With landings at three points and one point being at least 250 from the departure. The reason why they say that, somebody could just go 100 miles this way, 100 miles this way. 100 miles this way is 300, but none of them are 250 away.
jackets this morning, but we are representing. We are representing today. Plain and dirt simple. Yeah, that's uh, Kenny Price's channel. Uh, he flies a uh, M2 Citation for a company, and uh, on the side or a side hustle. Although the client may be a side hustle, and he does a lot of dirt work, yeah. so that's why it's plain and dirt simple. I'll put a link uh, yeah. to his channel. He's a really great guy, uh, just solid as they come. Um, yeah, and uh, it's kind of fun to watch him use those. Uh, kids probably would love to watch him using those big machines, uh, big, a uh, lot of ponds and stuff. And he does a lot of uh, ponds, clearing ponds, doing berms. You know, uh, you know. So it, it's mixed in there. Yeah. You know, so it's yeah. not all dirt work and not all flying. But yeah, I mean, some of it. I, yeah, a little kid get his little Tonka truck out or his little Tonka backhoe out and, and watch him play a little bit. So anyway, Kenny. Thank you for representing today. Yeah. So anyway, and, and these are great shirts. These are the oh, shirts yeah. that they're uh, uh, SBF shirts. SBF and that we wear sailing. Yeah. And uh, so they're the Columbia shirts that we really like. And so anyway, again, thanks a lot, Kenny. We appreciate Kenny. it. Kenny. Oh, and Kenny too. Oh, oh. Not eating yet, but we do have a few, you know, chocolate chip cookies. Fit. So uh, comment below if you know what the story is on the chocolate chip cookies. Okay. But I'm, I'm interested to see how many people really know the story. Oh, everybody knows the story. Well, <laughs> maybe not, you know. I think most people know the story. Yeah, yeah. Well, we'll, we'll just we'll run a little <laughs> test and see how many know the story, you know. Okay. Want to land in Oak Mulgee? Good. My bad, my bad, Hotel. Hey, Kenny, you want to land in Oak Mulgee? Kilo Tango Hotel. 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 Three, six, zero, one, zero, gut, Okay, so we got to go, we got to lose 6,000 times three, so about 18, 20 miles out, we need to start our descent. Just about where we're at. <laughs> What you do, see, we're at 7,500, TPA is 7,500, so we've got to lose 6,000 feet. Uh, 6 times 3 is what? 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. Traffic eight zero five Charlie, half mile from Pages, yep. will be a ten mile straight up on Avonway, three five. Yeah. Old multi traffic, Skyline Angel Pompeco is eight to the northwest. Gonna enter left downwind, full stop three six. Old multi traffic, Skyline Angel Pompeco is six to the northwest. Gonna enter left downwind. Three six, full stop. Looks like you can kind of follow that road once it's straight. Yeah. Hey, four is here. Five four six eight inbound for the forty five two five. Traffic Skyline 80 Pompeco, last downwind, 36 full stop. Old Pokey. Old Mulgee Regional Airport. Automated weather observation. 1806 Zulu. Weather. Wind 350 at Niner. Gust 1 Niner. Just a slight left crosswind, right? Looks like it.
Monkey traffic, Skyline Angel Papeco entering left base, 36, full stop, hold Monkey. Skyline Angel Papeco, base to final 36, full stop, full point. Traffic Skyline Edge of Pateco, short final, 3 6, full stop, hold post. Aldi 650 Delta Mike is uh, going over Conkey and uh, landing 3 6. Traffic Skyline Bay Zero, pop back home, clear 36, going to FBO, hold point. It's looking for a lot of sit. Oh, we TBM 650 Delta Mike is on a five mile final 36, okay. You want trade planes? Rather be on the ground than in this plane a long time. I don't know how that goes. <laughs> Too bad land, it was gusty though. Yeah. Lots of Palamases around here. No, lots of nice planes around here. It's right back here, I think. It's actual FBO is. Get in front of us? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, look at all. What are those, Ron? Crop dusters. Turbo prop crop dusters, but they're crop. Pretty. Oh, welcome to Old Pokey. <laughs> Old Pokey, yeah, there we go. It should be right there in that building. I just now here's all the parking places and stuff. Yeah. That looks good. That's a fire. Leg done. Okmulgee Airport has such a rich and diverse history. Uh, we interviewed a while back Miss Jean Rands, who her and her husband were one of the managers of the airport after World War II, and learn and see where the connection is from Jean Autry and Marlon Brando at the airport as well. Uh, we'll put a link for the full interview with Miss Jean at the end of this video and just learn a little bit more about the rich history of Okmulgee Airport.